You've got someone... Tom, why don't you... T we know it's Rob's movies probably more publicly. Can you t give everyone sort of an overview of what Colony Capital does and some of the sort of prized, visible assets that you guys own and control? Yeah, I mean, Colony is a, is a, a private equity firm that has specialized in, in hard assets. And for, for those of, of you who don't know what private equity, it's a business that used to be in vogue until your president came into effect and is, is quickly depleting in prestige. But we're, we're, we're one of the, of the largest private equity firms in, in the world. We've got offices in, in 14 countries. We've got about $38 billion of assets under management. But in finding a niche, what we've always concentrated on our operating companies. So kind of real estate and hard asset base, but real estate is a pretty easy business, right? My, my first partner in life always used to say, every time you think you're so smart in the real estate business, take a look out the window of the buildings you didn't build, you didn't design, you don't own, or you're not a tenant in. And we all have a really personal relationship with real estate, not so much with nuclear physics, right? So I'd rather be a tech guy in nuclear physics because then when I go to get gas at the gas station, the gas station attendant is not telling me what a dummy I am for having just bought Xanadu, right? Every, everybody has a personal relationship with real estate, and over time, every individual has had expectations of substantially increasing their wealth through some real estate investment. So we always went to operating companies. We, we were the large shareholder of Carrefour. We're the large shareholder of Accor. We bought uh, the second... Uh, best baseball team in Japan, along with the platinum-domed uh, arena. We own Paris Saint-Germain, which unfortunately is the worst soccer team in Paris. Um, we own lots of companies and, and, and lots of stuff, and the idea is to add value to them over a three- to five-year period and produce what used to be historically high returns someplace in excess of 25%. You've done that consistently, so, you know, office buildings, casinos, large, large residential properties, all these in your portfolios and your funds, including that beautiful project in the marina that you acquired a few years back.